Hey, we're doing some Arca at Phoenix. Just barely got uh, got this in this week. Um, it's Monday, right before the track changes. Um, I always like to do the Arca race each week, and I almost didn't make it this time, but uh, found some time today, feeling pretty good, so got in here. Um, everyone else has already done their race, though, and they've uh, had enough of Arca at Phoenix, though, I guess, because. Uh, not the highest participation, and uh, as you can see, we're the number three car, so unfortunately, the game's expecting big things from us. <laughs> A podium finish, I guess. And uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to provide that, because uh, Phoenix has not always been my greatest. Uh, let me focus here, try to focus on my lap. As I get loose out of turn one, um, I've never felt stable here. I always feel erratic when I come on by down to Phoenix. Oof. Yeah. Just, I never feel quite stable, so. Not sure how this is gonna go. Last lap time was at 28.4. Thinking that probably wasn't the greatest lap because I'm already third, and I'm sure not very many people have qualified yet. So looks like we'll get a better lap this time, though. I just barely didn't get as much of a runoff. So uh, 28, 3, 6, 5. Four That's good for third. Uh, and thankfully, we're not <laughs> one of three people that have qualified. So. Pretty close, pretty close up there. We got 28.333 as the pole time, so we're uh, we're right there. And then we got a nice little gap behind us at the moment, about a tenth, more a bit more of a tenth behind us in fourth for now. We're still qualifying, obviously. So, um, yeah, I just never quite feel stable here, so. I, I've caused wrecks before, which I absolutely hate. I care about safety rating more than I do I rating, so I hate causing wrecks, and so I'm haunted by a wreck I caused like a year ago. <laughs> but it uh, happened here at Phoenix, and I think about it every time I'm here. I just I hate ruining people's races, so it sticks with me for a long time. But, uh, you know, I've learned from it. It happened because I went into uh, turn three too hard and couldn't get the car to turn on old tires. So, you know, coming into here, I came in, I entered low, and uh, the car wasn't turning anymore, and I hit the guy, and felt terrible about it to this day. So, I continue to feel bad about it because that's how my brain works. But, uh, <laughs> hopefully we'll have a better time here. Hopefully I've uh, learned from my mistakes. Man, it's just, uh, I have the feeling I'm going to be one of those guys that just can't save tires. I don't know what my problem is, but I think maybe I need to get on the brakes harder. Get turned into the corner. I don't know, but it feels like I fall off really quick. I get my, like, one lap where I can allegedly put in a top three time, and then I don't know how long I'm going to be able to stay up there. I feel like I'm going to lose all of the track position. But maybe uh, if I go in there, knowing that's a possibility, maybe I can help mitigate it. We'll see. Um, you know, I'm not too picky. If I can get a top 10, I'm always happy. <laughs> I mean, as long as it's not a 10 car field, you know what I mean? It's uh, modest expectations. Uh, clean race is all I usually strive for. And uh, that's something I'm going to be focusing on. Since. It's not always uh, so easy for me here at Phoenix or other, you know, short tracks. I consider this a short track, even though it's a little longer than some of the, uh, you know, actual short tracks. But uh, it certainly races like one. You know, you're breaking at every corner and stuff, so it's a short track. At least it's the better version, uh, in my opinion. I hate having to, you know, cut through the grass or, you know, cut through right here because that just causes mayhem every time it feels like people running into each other 
so I'm glad I don't have to deal with that here. Got a nice, some nice greenery to look at instead. Um, that was quick. <laughs> Did everyone qualify? Maybe. Maybe that guy, like, uh, put in some fake times. <laughs> you know, where they, uh, get this black flag and just put some times in so, uh, we can get going. We got One third. Go. Next time by, you'll be lining up That's cool. Inside. Closed. Pit road is closed. Uh, let's get everything sorted. So if we have to take our quick repair, fast repair, we can. It's real, uh, it's real loose. First couple of laps, so I'm gonna have to make sure I'm aware and ready for that. I got my brake bias set back. Um, initially when I was practicing, I tried 16 to 1 steering ratio, but that was just, uh, I couldn't, uh, handle the car. I was, you know, erratic. So I moved that down to 14, and, uh, and now I feel like I've got a better handle on it, and hopefully we'll save tires a little better. Um, whew, nervous though. Because uh, I uh, I would much prefer going into the race feeling no like 100%. You know, right. I know I'm gonna be able to hold the line every time, um, and I feel like I can do a great uh, a good enough job here, or else I wouldn't be doing a race. You know, I don't do a race if I feel like I'm just gonna start wrecking into people. But uh, is this muted? No. Um, but. You know, just uh, not as comfortable as I would like to be. But that's pretty much any short track for me, so. Uh, gonna have to live with it. Uh, let's see how the car reacts on throttle. Seems fine. Okay. I'm just hoping we can get an early gap, maybe. Get some breathing room so I can focus on driving. Uh-oh. Someone has disconnected. Is that someone near us? I don't know. I didn't see where they were from, but... Hey, maybe I won't finish last now. <laughs> That's the goal. Don't finish last. This guy's got his blue stripe or something. That's interesting. I didn't know you could do that. Uh, let me focus on getting a good start instead of uh, his bumper. Green flag. Green flag. slow start, but I just wanted to be careful, so I'm not too upset with that. Real slow there here, that's interesting. Two car was. That's fine. Maybe he'll promote me to save these darn tires. And you got a little bit of breathing room. How about that? All my wishes are coming true. Let me just make that special effort to save tires. The leader's just done it. Just want to do enough. The car is just done it. Twenty-eight point five. The guy behind has just done it. Twenty-eight point seven. I don't want to be looking at last or best lap. I want to look at last lap. throttle in there, it'll help it turn, and uh, where the rears at a better rate than the fronts. That lap was at 28.7, good lap, that's your quickest today. Right. How do we have people in the back already? I guess there was some wrecking going on. Oh boy, we got some lap traffic early. So, I'll repeat what I said earlier, we've got... Uh, bit of low participation which means the guys in the that are higher numbers are going to be pretty low ratings probably which means more likely we get chaos so it's something to be aware of as we approach them very happy with my little uh, area I've carved out here I'm going to focus on saving tires and Keeping steady. And maybe we can catch up to the guys ahead later. If he 
you get turn one right and get the run off, you, you make so much more time. But it's, for me anyway, it's hard to get just right on a consistent basis. Just uh, something I don't have 100% figured out about this track. This nine car is erratic. I'm trying to wreck the guy in front of me. It's a lap car. Not gonna be fun trying to get by him. It's like taking a long walk. Look at that. That's scary. I'm scared. Somebody please hold me. Oh, I gotta get by this guy. Jeff Gordon. <laughs> That's a Jeff Gordon scheme in it. You've just done a 28 point so. You really should be running like a high line. Let someone get by you. It is kind of tough at this track, though. So, not gonna grumble too much as long as the guy doesn't bend it right in front of me and kill me. Then I'm gonna grumble. And you can't stop me. The lap time was at 28.9. Pardon me. Excuse me. Outside. Get back off, lap car. Dang. Outside is clear. Closing the door on you. Better know that uh, I have the right of way. So I'm taking it. Okay. And we're fine. We're fine. We survived. Don't think we lost too much time doing that. Still got my comfy little hidey hole here in fourth place. Comfy. Oh, okay, that's less comfy. Don't hit the apron. Apron bad. That was a uh, 29.1. Yep, <laughs> it's getting hard to turn already. I don't know what I'm doing at this track, man. it too hard. Yep. Sure doesn't feel like I pushed it too hard, but I just never had too much success here, so. Keep the car straight and see where we end up. Try to uh, keep consistent laps. Maybe even improve a little bit each time. I know I have a problem getting on the gas too early in turn one whenever I have uh, older tires. So I'm gonna maybe think about that. usually a bad sign. I'm just unfortunate for that poor guy who probably got wrecked or ended up wrecked and then uh, doesn't get to finish where he may have deserved. He may have uh, been a guy up here passing me at some point had his uh, luck gone a bit differently. Almost hit that apron again and it's still a bad corner. Uh, gross. Super inconsistent. I mean, you can just look at my uh, session last lap 
comparisons and then like one lap I'll just be way off the next I'll be like way in the green and it's just I just don't get this track I don't think I can't run it consistently and that uh, lack of consistency probably culminates in bad tire wear as well you know guys who can keep it steady and run the line they need to run on a consistent basis are gonna wear the tires better and when I'm just going all over the place not knowing what I'm doing like that then I'm probably just burning off the wrong side of the tire you know so. a little hard I think oof funny uh, the guy in front still pulling away the guys behind are still backing up so we're getting more and more lonely out here and that is a-okay with me all right that felt better distance. Now I'm plus 07. Do a good lap. Do a poor lap. Alternate. Preheat oven to 350 degrees. That's how you get... That's probably going to be a fourth place finish. Thank you. getting to uh, fighting up there, so maybe I'll gain some ground on second and third. Back to kind of the back of the next run up the corner there. Caught a car. Go on by. Outside. <laughs> Still there. Thank you. It's off and on. <sighs> Yeah, I didn't want to run up into them, so I had to get out to the corner real slow. I think that's what you did. Yeah, I moved and the awful. So we had a bad lap there. Because uh, normally I'd like to hit the gas on the exit, go up towards the wall, and uh, the guy was there, so. So, I don't even know if I took that corner correctly because my familiarity with the track is so bad and uh, that's comparing to the last lap where he lost a bunch of time. So, did I take it right that time? I don't even know. Who even knows, man? Is this four falling off? I think we had a pass ahead. So maybe that four is falling off and we can get some distance on him. Keep an eye on uh, on that number. I'll look at it once we get to the line here, and then we can have that as a reference point. To see how we are in comparison to he. Another right corner, and it looks like we're at like 2.2. Kind of tight in that corner. That's so great. Got a little loose. Got a little part there. Two point two again. <laughs> so as as of right now, that lap time was twenty nine point five. Still holding even. Yeah, that was pretty good. I think if I angle it right, I can get off the corner a little better. That helps my turn one. Okay. Hey, we gained a little bit. We're 
going to have to gain a little bit more than that, though, in order to catch him by the time this one's over. Yeah, well, <laughs> less of a good corner. It is a uh, check you have to do some thought. That makes a pretty fun to run. Um, we've got some shade. That means we might get some more grip here in a moment. Get that run off in turn one, it really helps. So you go through this, this portion of the track. Too low there. Kill the run off ahead. Gross. Just can't keep it consistent. Went in there too hard. Ew, that's awful. <laughs> Fun. That's a good thing. Look at the bright sides. Haven't hit the wall yet. The lap time was 29.5. See, that felt okay, and then plus two. It's gonna make it plus three. Yes. I don't know how this track is even supposed to feel. I mean, we're slowly gaining, but not enough that we would got any got chance to, to get to him, much less pass him by the time it's over, I don't think so. Unless I figure out how to be consistent, I don't know if it's going to happen. Or if they start fighting. I'll, I'll put my best laps in, give myself a chance. Too early, and I didn't uh, turn in enough. You're blinking fast. So then I started adding too much towards the wall, and it's just just an overall bad time. <laughs> Nathan, I'm going to go high in one, and you go by on the low side. Seems like it's been a pretty clean race. Um, ooh, I got closer to the wall there. Uh, haven't seen a bunch of dead cars on the apron or anything. And uh, guys are being friendly for the most part, it seems like. You know, a lot of cars saying, hey, I'm going to be here. It's always good to, good to see. Feels like I take the corners different every time. I'm just so inconsistent. Five, five to go. I'm consistently yeah. saying that I'm inconsistent. So that's something. Consistently inconsistent. I wonder if I should have been moving my brake lights back. I feel like that's not the problem. I feel like I'm getting turned in just fine. I'm just not a good driver. <laughs>
good. Outside. Gotta hit the wall or something. Clear up top. I think so. Unless he just backed off that hard. It looks like he hit the wall though. Ooh, that was a wall hit. That was a real wall hit by the guy in front of me. Is there a chance? Could we have excitement in these last couple of laps? Is this lap car gonna get out of my way? You've got two laps to go. Oh my god, what are you doing, man? Car outside. Looks like he's blocking the inside like he's taking the defensive drive. line or something. Clear outside. That hurt us a lot. But everyone's got to get through the lap traffic. So, it's not like it was uh, specifically me. Last lap. Mm -hmm. Gonna be within one second. Mm -hmm. Turn, car, turn! Oh. <laughs> Tried to push it a little harder there, just in case. But I'll show you how tough it ended up hurting me more than anything. So. Or go on. Yep, that's that. Alright, I'm still happy with that though. Fourth place, top five. Right about chicken. where I was supposed to finish. Chicken flag, chicken flag. Good race, good win. Nice run. Solid work. All right. Good win. Glad I got this race in, though. Um, Thank you. Always like Arca. It's a very fun car to drive. Bob, you lucky and, ain't uh, a dirty driver, man, because I could have pushed you out of my way a number of times. Oh, we got Angie. No. Um. Yeah, I really like this car, so it's always nice to get this in. Um. Very fun car to drive. Um. Oh, yeah, okay. Started third. Number three car, finished fourth, top five. Oh, yeah. Especially at a track uh, I'm not always great at. I'm happy with that. So, we are lap one. Let's take a look and see what happened out there. Oh, man. What, how did this start? That looked like it was already in progress. He's already way back here. How happened oh he started from the pits that's curious so he starts from the pits I guess expecting a mess and then immediately <laughs> on his first lap hits the gas a little bit too hard and starts fishtailing oh no he am become mess destroyer of worlds. Destroy all worlds. <laughs> Pardon my inability to speak the English language. Hey, I like that car. Oreo Ritz Lincoln. I feel like I could have used a different number font though. This guy again. This guy maybe needed a little more practice. See he's in the wall. I'm sure he's front of the leaders and stuff now. I remember I was a little scared trying to pass him, because uh, you could just kind of tell. Didn't have it quite figured out. Got some wall hits. We got some blinkies. Hello again. Mm hmm. It's unfortunate. We got this like. What color green is that? It's like a. It's like an army green or something. I don't know, an olive maybe. I don't know. Hit the wall though. Bop. Oh, that could have been worse. Guy behind him, I knew where to go. He went into that corner way too hard. Holy smokes. Gonna need some more banking if you plan on making that entry speed work. Uh, blinkies. Nope, yeah. That's a uh, wall on entry. Mm -hmm. Wall on entry. Cool name, Jonathan X. William. 
want an X in my name. Uh, that's familiar. Uh, more wall hits. Not too much uh, car by car contact. That's good. Especially because it wasn't me doing it. These other guys oh, <laughs> hitting that ramp on the grass. That's always fun. It's like a little ramp <laughs> where that grass starts and gets you a little airborne. Is that the end of the race? Wow, very clean race. One car got first. Congrats to him. We got fourth, top five. Fun day. All right. And uh, soon enough, we'll be doing uh, whatever's next on the ARCA schedule, I guess. I don't know if it's going to be tonight or whatever, but um, more in the future, that's for sure. Thanks for watching.